today's the day. Today's the day. Crack fest it is. Pretty excited about this. Been waiting a long time for this event to happen. Let's get in there, see what the uh, craziness is about. <laughs> Standard competition. Well, you get a t shirt, standard, a roll of tape, a scorecard, and then also how to tape up the, the hand jamming, but also how to tape up for, fish, for finger jamming as well, which is quite cute. That's quite clever to go with that. We are going to start. The competition is open. Go for it. <laughs> <laughs> in the bag. So this one you've got to start back there somewhere and it's a time challenge so you've got to squeeze through this awkward gap somewhere and then get to this hole to finish. Um, so we'll see. I think, I think, no, I think we've been... Mm-mm-mm. 
is not how we normally climb with chalk bags on the front. <laughs> but, uh, it needs mass when you're a crack bag. So we grab Pete, one of the white boys who's been setting up competitions. So tell us about Crackfest. How did it come about? So Crackfest came about from, I guess it was an extension from the Crack School series that we've run over the last couple of years. Um, so we did those and then people at the end of the sessions always wanted to like carry on practicing on the cracks that we'd made and we just yeah. thought, ah, oh, we need to sort of like extend this and give people the chance to be able to practice crack climbing in a fun, yeah. environment so we still had the crack schools going on today but then people could also like enter the crack competition and also try the, the different challenges that we had and yeah basically just have a load of fun on some crack themes based problems yeah because i was wondering how you would make 25 different folded problems you know all crack based but all different and, yeah and i gotta say you managed it yeah <laughs> they were Maybe each one was different and interesting and stuff like that. Yeah, I just say like with the, the setting and stuff, I think we really wanted to like show that crack climbing didn't just have to be like a pure splitter from bottom to top. Yeah. And it, you know, you can yeah. have crack climbing and crack climbing moves incorporated in into normal styles and everyday climbing yeah. uh, and that's like what we wanted to kind of show that you can have this yeah. like weird and bizarre like all these body bridging techniques and hand jams but you can also mix it in with like the modern style jumping and um, all this kind of stuff and that's sort of like where we wanted to go with it and like yeah. what we want to show people. And it was great seeing people at all levels, people that never cracked like before. Yeah. Some of the real bigger wads turning up. And yeah. This, this, so everyone seemed to be able to find something to do and enjoy it. I think people yeah. people enjoyed it. Didn't lose too much skin, I don't think. <laughs> Speak for yourself. Yeah. I've got yeah. missing all over yeah. me. Yeah. Uh, well, look forward to seeing what you guys come up with next year. Yeah. Uh, excited for that. Yeah. Back here, or are you going? I think, yeah, yeah, like at, at the depot, the guys at the depot have been like amazing. I mean, I don't know who else would have agreed to this <laughs> idea yeah. and, and the, the depot just agreed to it straight away it's and it, yeah yeah no, they, they just like oh yeah that's a great idea let's do it let's make it happen and I think it's like with that enthusiasm that's when you get a good event so it's also like yeah massive thanks to the depot for sort of like yeah. letting us loose <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks for an amazing competition thanks for speaking to us yeah and, um, yeah of course yeah good luck with the rest of the white boys and yeah, see cheers. you next year for yeah. the next crack thank you yeah oh. good it's in true white boys fashion there's always a comedy element to things this one's called the rhino challenge so it's a no-handed challenge <laughs> you have to wear uh -huh. Obviously. Yeah, and ring the bell with your head. I feel like the hat's gonna fall off. Or I'm gonna like strangle myself with this. Are <laughs> you allowed your hands just to get into it? <laughs> Oh, great. <laughs>
<laughs> I don't know how you move. How do you move with this? You love that? No hands. Please, it's more than one, huh? I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to. Oh, there's one more. All right, this one is. It's not actually that far away. I like to see Will Baisley try this. Yeah, I did change my mind about at least five times to do that route. It's a voyage of discovery. This is the RAB one. So you have a RAB expedition suit, um, timed, and you have to put the suit on and get up the tunnel, ring the bell, stop the clock. I have a slight issue with the... Uh... Give it a bash. Am I allowed to turn the edges up? <laughs> It'll just, take longer. It'll just take longer. Just go through. Alright. You ready? I think so. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Most expensive seat toy. I guess it, I was fast in the rhino because yeah. I didn't realise that was timed. <laughs> it's so big on you. You put it very, on, very warm. Very, very <laughs> for, for someone quite small. Everyone else is really struggling. You put it on the screen. Three, two, one, go.
there is a hang tough challenge or a hand jam hang tough challenge. See how long you can hold a hand jam. You ready? Three, two, one, good. Like it's sort of wedged in there, you're like, yeah, it's fine, you can hang it for ages, and then you sort of slowly start slipping out of it. Well, we've finished the competition, scorecards are uh, all submitted. There's also the raffle, so there's still some hope for us to win a prize. <laughs> I think seeing Will Bosey in a rhino hat headbutting a wall. Oh, look, that, that, was, that was a special yeah. moment. It was very special. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, one highlight of the day. In first place with a really freaking high score overall is Mari, the crack queen, Augustus. Augusta. <laughs> okay, in first place was Ben Bruns. Well, amazing time at Crackfest. Um, well done to the white boys for putting on a really that was awesome. Really fun competition. It's like the most fun I've had at a competition for. Yes, well, quite a, comp a, a comp should be. A comp should be fun and light-hearted, but also has that serious element to it. Yeah, and it was just, just a really fun atmosphere and lots of people encouraging, helping each other, nobody really taking it very seriously and just playing around on all the different cracks. There's no skin lost compared yeah. to the competition. Yeah, I definitely <laughs> ache in a lot of very odd places and I've lost yeah. skin in a few places, but it was, it was definitely worth it. It was a really good... Good crack. <laughs> Really good comp. Uh, well done, white boys. Nice one. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.